Hello, Simon here, and this is Maya 0.57, the latest alpha release. This themed update is for the medical room, which is why it's called Theme Hospital. First of all, though, I'm going to go outside as I need to destroy some plants. Although someone has just died there in the airlock. So that's a, that's a good start to the video. I'm just going to destroy these plants because they're damaging my equipment outside and they can also block the path to my base. Just going to kill some of the larger ones. Then I'm going to let him go back inside. I'm just going to wait for this person to desuit. There we go. And I'll let the imp go free. We can deal with the low atmosphere problem with our new item, the emergency air system, which releases a small blast of air into a room that needs it. When clicked, and slowly replenishes its stores afterwards. We see the imp's picked up the body and is taking it to the medical room. This is because in our new hospital update, there is a body storage unit. The imp will place the dead body in there and then we'll see one of the doors close off and now that corpse is safely stored. You no longer need to leave your body bags in the storage room. So that's the person who died and an email. So you'll notice the emails are again more complex and more useful. The colonists will start talking about the symptoms of any new diseases they've picked up and with there being several new diseases it's good keeping an eye on those emails and seeing what's bugging them. So we're going to build an atmosphere generator because this room's too cold and needs some atmosphere. That beep is the atmosphere generator telling us it's full again. So next up is the food which has been massively balanced. You see the food preparation systems are faster, the colonists are better at filling them, the colonists are better at uh, planning their meals. Also the manifest has been improved to show you more data about the food in your base so you can make better judgement, see how much day days of food you have. So I have two days but that's quickly going up and how many chickens you have and how much food that would turn into. Also on the plants, we now have an estimate of the amount of kilojoules of energy that's in them when turned into food. You'll notice that goes up when they start to grow and the light affects that so you might want to be using that next time you want to figure out what's the optimum lighting setup for your plants. We've got some doors there that are flickering, which shows they're damaged. Someone's gone into the medical room and is using the scanner. Low temperature warning in living area. And someone's just died of hypothermia somewhere else in the base. And she's just given up on the scanner. So it turns out that she's in perfect health and is just being a hypochondriac. Colonists will go use scanners when they're not ill. Um, but this colonist does appear to be ill as their vision has become blurry. And that colonist is dead on the floor, so he's also quite ill. So there's another person going to use the medical room. There's several new diseases from things like irradiation to gastric distress from eating raw food. Um, each one is affected in subtle different ways and will be affected by your gameplay. Say if you have a base with lots of uh, blue lighting, you might get more people on constant downers and getting depressed. Red lighting might give people high blood pressure, but it turns out this woman is also just a hypochondriac. Still, nothing wrong with being uh, overly cautious. So I'm going to call in some new colonists. will be in good health. With the medical room, um, people will take treatments from the dispenser once they've been checked out by the scanner and then will sit on the medical beds and maybe treated by any colonist who has a doctor skill. I'm just going to build some repair bots so we can get those doors fixed. I'm going to dig out this area because I want to build another room. And when I'm building another room, there's now a new bit of user interface which unifies this uh, scroller with the object building which allows you to pick objects a bit easier 
and a little faster. I can turn that atmosphere generator off as it's sapping the power from my base. I can see someone the other side of the base is getting a scan right now, so hopefully that's the sick person. Yep. Yeah. So they have high blood pressure, which means too much of the lighting in my base is red. I'm putting them under too much stress. Um, so I might want to give them more um, friendly environment, maybe some more blue lighting, maybe some more house plants around the place. Maybe give them more time to relax. But yeah, that's May 0.57. I'll be back in a month with another update. You have a nice summer, and I will see you soon. Bye.